Welcome back to VLAS video tutorial. In this part we will take you through the uh, basic steps of transcribing your material in Elan. First of all we will show you how you make some basic annotations and then we will take you through uh, some of the different modes that enable a faster and more structured transcription uh, in Elan. But first let's have a look at how you uh, type in uh, uh, your transcript uh, very basically in Elan. Yes. So first of all, we need to uh, select what we want to transcribe, and this is just a dummy selection, so this is not uh, a 100% correct, but you select what you want to transcribe, and then you double-click the selection, which brings up this white text box, and then we could type in, uh, hello, my name is... Yeah. And if you press enter, you can now see, if I remove the selection, that we have this blue select, uh, annotation with the transcription, hello, my name is John. But there's also another way of doing transcription. If you go to options and segmentation mode, yeah. You can see our segmentation or our annotation from before is here. We'll first of all we'll delete this to start over. And then it's important that you always uh, have a look at the uh, which tire you are in at the moment. And if you use your arrows, up and down arrows on your keyboard, you can see that I can now switch between interviewer and McCain. If we just uh, stick with McCain for now. Uh, and type in a, a dummy segmentation. Uh, I could play the video and here I use control and space and we say that he's uh, definitely saying something here. I hit enter in order to mark the in point of my uh, segmentation and then I play the video a little bit further and then I hit enter again to end my segmentation. Yes. Now I want to go to uh, the interviewee and you can see that uh, there's nothing put into this tire. So this is also a very nice way of structuring your transcription. Mm -hmm. And we play the video a little further, and then the interviewee starts talking. And I think she's stopping here. And now you see we have two segment, uh, a segmentation on each tire. We'll just add another short one. The nice thing about the uh, segmentation mode is that compared to the uh, default annotation mode, you can now uh, move around uh, your segmentation. So it was maybe not that precise, so I will just move the, the segmentation a little bit. And I think this one was a little bit further ahead. And you can also, if you discover that you've uh, annotated too much or too little, you can also click the end of your annotation and drag and drop this so you can make it longer or shorter. Great. There's a variety of different uh, functions up here where you can uh, uh, adjust how you put uh, or how you enter your segmentation. Uh, I prefer to uh, use this delayed mode where you can uh, put in your segmentation uh, uh, accordingly to how fast you can hit the enter uh, button. So now it will uh, add a little bit of time before I enter uh, and also in the end. In that way I know that uh, my hearing and my uh, 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 possibility to, to hit the key is uh, adjusted. Yeah. So now we have our dummy annotation and we go back to options and now we choose transcription mode. So basically in segmentation mode, you don't transcribe, you only segment your data. And if you go to transcription mode, this new window pops up. And in a previous video, we uh, created the linguistic type of talk, which is what we want to transcribe now. So we select talk and then we press apply. This brings up the two um, participants that we uh, created in the tier um, as well as the different segmentations that we've made. 
So if we click McCain number one, you can type in your transcription. And the smart way of by, by using uh, the transcription mode is that when you click this particular window, you only hear the audio or the, the, yeah, the audio uh, which is within the segmentation that you made previously. Yeah. And we can do this for interviewer as well. And the next one. Last one. <clears throat> and if you imagine you've uh, segmented and transcribed your entire data, you can go back to uh, options and annotation mode. And this brings you back to the uh, main window, which we were working in previously. And you can now see that within our two tiers, McCain and interviewer, we have the segmentations with with the transcriptions we just uh, added. It might be, uh, depending on how long your media file is, you might want to zoom out and in. You can do this down in the corner here. Just to get an overview, if you zoom very far out, you can get an overview of all your, uh, all your segmentations, annotations and transcriptions in your entire video corpus. But you can also zoom in if you really want a detailed view of perhaps one specific annotation. So, yeah. yes. That was uh, a bit about uh, annotating and transcribing segment, segmenting uh, in Elan. Uh, in the next video uh, we are going to show you uh, how you used controlled vocabularies and finally we will show you how you export your material to a Word document. Uh, thank you for now. See you next time. See you around.